All right, maybe it's going to hold this time. <laughs> um, I think we're live. I think this is going to work. All right, let me try to get the game started for the fourth time. Uh, it's going to be a technical night, I have a feeling, guys. Trying to get the stream started. It's dropped four times, the broadcast software. And, yeah, it's just one of those days today. So... Sorry I'm late, um, some of this was, if you saw the false starts, the broadcast software giving up, and some of this was me trying to give Lolo her medicine, and <laughs> she fed it to her brother. <sighs> yeah. Uh, it's gonna be a fun night, I have a feeling. Definitely, definitely have that feeling. It may also be a shorter stream. Oh, shoot. It may also be a shorter stream just based on the fact that I'm not feeling so well myself either tonight. So, anyways, while we're here, let's get this show on the road. We'll see what happens. And uh, while we're here, I'm going to think of different ways to get Lola to actually take her medicine. <laughs> so. Yay, we might as well just jump into it now, huh? It seems like the stream is steady. It seems like it's going to hold. And one more. Sure, why not? Okay, so if you guys lose me, I'll try to get you back as soon as possible. Or if I lose you. Not sure, I think I'd be me losing you. Anyways, welcome to the Friday Night Fallout stream. I have... Welcome home, madam. Somewhat of an idea I what I'm doing. Oh, shh. I told him to wait there, didn't I? Never did find the fluffy cover for this either. Um. I, I had hoped you'd return. What not? Yeah, Miss Lolo is, uh, haste. is a fixed girl, and she's an older girl. And she's starting to have some issues. Follow. So she's supposed to have some medicine to help her... Um, instead of being a drippy faucet, shall we say. And she proceeded, I put it on a really nice cookie for her. Um, she didn't want to lick it as much as the vet said, no, no, she'll, she'll lick it. Don't worry. No problem. So I put it on a cookie thinking that would be good. And nope. And she took it and chewed some of it and then proceeded to dump it on the floor medicine side down and then leave most half of it for her brother to eat. I'm sure estrogen is going to work well for him. So. Yeah, so there's going to have to be an alternate trial with that with her. Maybe some bread and cheese or something. I don't know. Anyways. So that's my fun. I figure technical difficulties are going to be um, sort of the way the day is going to go. So y'all are forewarned, especially with that four time trying to start. Let's go see if we can get this guy mezzed and enslaved because he shot at us and he's a bit of a jerk. Probably should have left Fox home. Oh well. My game sound seems really incredibly quiet. Something troubling you, my friend? Okay, no, we're good. And I shall follow. Alright. Um Yeah, so it's gonna be it's gonna be interesting to try to sort something out for her to kind of bait her into. Um Debating her into taking her medicine. And it smells like gravy. Dude, I'm not kidding you guys. It smells like gravy. Like, I want to have it. So. I'm a little bit sad for her. Oh, Fox, please don't kill him. I'm 
he kills him, I'm definitely gonna have to leave Fox behind while I do this because... <sighs> Alright, um, no, we don't want to save. We're going to go back to my house. We're going to ask Fox to wait here. We're going to leave Fox waiting here. I'm going to come. I'm going to manage the guy. And then we'll come back and get Fox. That's the plan. Because Fox is going to kill him otherwise. So. <sighs> Hi, gamer. Alright. So. Um, yeah, this medicine was not cheap either. It's like. very little and it's like 60 bucks so here's a hoping I can figure out a way to trick her maybe some bread and cheese or something I don't know that's my hope anyways but well that and she doesn't feed her her essentially estrogen to her brother because I don't think that's gonna work her girl hormones to her brother. I don't think it'll help. So. <laughs> yeah, I kind of I kind of debated if it should have gone in with her food, and I'm still kind of debating it, which may mean changing her feeding times. So. <laughs> it means changing her feeding times so it's hidden in the food. I mean, I'm definitely not opposed to that. You know, whatever gets the job done, whether it's bread and cheese or what it is, I really don't care as long as she, uh... As long as she, uh... Takes it. Where did this guy go? He's gonna get killed. Oh, that was, oh, I'm gonna get my leg blown off for that for that karma. All right, and equip. Whoa, is it me or is the world spinning? I feel horrible doing this to me. Doing this to me. Doing this to him. Yeah, good idea. Okay, here you go. I'm pretty tired. Thanks. I'm sorry my brain is not working right now. Sure. What's this thing for anyway? My pop. Uh, a slip. That's horrible. I feel horrible. I feel worse than sending him off in his underwear. Jeez. <sighs> so. So yeah. I, uh, I have to figure out something. Oh, here comes Miss, the Miss Sneaky. Sneaky Miss, Sneaky, Sneaky, Sneaky. No, there's nothing. I didn't do anything wrong. You just spent 400 bucks at the vet today to, for me to, you know, get this medicine and me to feed it to my brother. <sighs> Children, furry or not furry, I'm telling you. So that's my TMI. Um, I mean, technically, it's about the dog, so it's probably not that bad. 
<laughs> or I hope it's not that bad. She's going to be fine. She's just... Because she's been fixed. And... She's getting older. Um, it's apparently really, really common, so... A couple ways that we could have gone, and... I just decided that... But uh, the better, the quicker, and then we could get her back to herself again, which is a good thing. So, now assuming she doesn't feed it to her brother, that is the variable the there, isn't it? some crazy things going on out there in the capital wasteland but this one just might beat them all i've been getting some scattered reports that a couple of costume kooks have been battling for control of the settlement yeah we're not doing that tonight i know it's got to be done but we're not doing that tonight um like i said i'm not necessarily feeling so great myself tonight so we may be looking at a shortened stream. I, I hope not, but I'm playing it by ear. Just so you guys know. Um, yeah. And then I have to come up with blackmail for the dog, so she'll take her medicine. Too. <laughs> oh, she's too smart for her own good. That's That's the problem. On the happy note, I mean, apparently her eyes are very good. She has no clouding. Her heart is very good. So, a little bit of a, you know, drippy faucet. <laughs> Not necessarily the worst of all things, right? why dog meets home in this game just so we're clear <laughs> I have a thing for my puppies and you know and do what I can for them so you know the looting teddy bear thing well I mean that just happens <laughs> So welcome to the stream. Welcome to Friday Night Followed. I'm sorry it's not as enthusiastic as it can be. But uh, thank you guys for coming and tuning in. And putting up with the silliness that is me. Alright, now that we're not jumping around like crazy crazy jumping beans I will attempt to scavenge and yeah as far as plan I have no plan for the night so we're just gonna kind of wing this broadcast totally by the seat of our pants. Which is pretty much how I do every broadcast, honestly, but it's okay. It's all good. We have to turn it off for the sake of the music. Otherwise, I would love to listen to Three Dog. But YouTube doesn't really love it when I listen to it, so. Ah, my foolish, foolish dogs. 
My foolish dogs. So that's my excitement. You know, I hope things are... are not as terribly exciting with you. I hope they're wonderful but horribly boring. Because, you know, boring can be good. It means there's no major traumas and things going on. <laughs> so, you know, that can be a very good thing, guys. Don't ever underestimate boring with nothing going on. So, uh, Gamer, are you going to be streaming tonight? Or do you know yet? If I may be so bold as to ask in my stream. Because for those of you who, um, you don't know yet, okay. For those of you who don't know, um, uh, on Wednesday after Skyrim, Gamer went and did a little ESO. Um, and it's a, a quiet stream, so for those of you who don't like chatter, or who, you know, you're looking to just... <sighs> don't you dare quit on me, game! No, apparently. <clears throat> it's gonna be a technical night, guys. It's gonna be, it's gonna be a... a... A hurdling night. I'm gonna call it hurdles because that's what you gotta jump over when you, you know, you run track and field and you gotta jump those things. So, so we've had the broadcast software quit four times. Fallout quit once. Lola is feeding her her girly her girly stuff to her brother. It's the night, guys. Um, yeah, so uh, back on to the topic of that. Yes, it's um, a quiet stream. So if you guys don't, um, like, you want something relaxing, you want to watch the gameplay and not be bothered with, like, listening to a lot of chatter, this is uh, probably a pretty good stream. So when he throws it up, I would say keep an eye out. I'd say Hedgy probably does a broadcast somewhere in between the two of us as far as um, chattiness. So. I have been L oh, so disappointed with this thing. Come back here and be like, I have a hundred now. No. Oh look, you can see my uh, you can see the house and a reflection of the window of my actual house. That's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. What's well, not cool is the crap that's in that. But anyways, oh, spoiler alert! If you've never opened it, you weren't missing anything. All right, <laughs> promise. In my opinion, anyways, I will phrase it that way. That little house. So. Yeah. Um. Totally lost my train of thought. Because in my head I'm playing, what can I feed Lola that she will eat? <laughs> Not try to pawn off on her brother. <laughs> Probably I'm just going to do it in her food. That or the bread and cheese thing. Make little bread balls and soak them with it. Or not soak them, but the amount she's supposed to get. And then cross my fingers and hope she doesn't roll it over to her brother. <laughs> oh my goodness.
Yeah, I never actually came through everything here. Uh, when I came to do the original go to minefield and bring Moira back a mine. I just kind of came through and ran it and then left, so. Aww. No. Sorry, I get to check under the bed. You never know. There could be like stuff under the bed. All right. Always fun to watch me go out in the wasteland. Never fail to come back with like seventy pounds of stuff. And blowing half a leg off. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. There's some stuff I wonder how I didn't, but like I said, I know when I got here I was just kind of running through to get that done, so. Baseball bat time, I think. We're not going to shoot the rad witches. This will this will be fine. That sound is like creepy as all heck. How much weight do I have? Not really. <laughs> I mean, maybe. We'll see. Right? Don't ever underestimate these guys. They will screw you up pretty fast. I'm just saying. If you guys have played uh, the vault app that they have, you guys will especially understand that. <laughs> Man, you get a room full of those things, and your vault will go pretty quick. <laughs> it's kind of funny and kind of sad. Okay, that was just a sink. Ooh, hit and a miss. Hitting a miss. Wow. Swinging a miss. <gasps> oh. That's why you guys love me. Therapy is all heck. That's me. I, these blocks annoy me because I really want to be able to take them home. And I can't. That makes me sad. Not as sad as some of the crap going on in the game, mind you, but it's aggravating because I'd really like to. Okay, guys. I don't want to walk on your bodies. It's just rude. I really want that. Hey, come here so I can kill you. Thank you. I'm gonna have to go through and read those books. See, this is the one that has the safe. I knew there was one that had a safe under the bed. Ooh. All right, let's read. Let us read. This, 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 and that. Pretty good haul of books, honestly, for coming through here, so yay. You might want more than that when we leave the house, but Okay. 
I think we are good here. Oh, well, as good as we get, right? Oh my god. Okay, seriously? I thought that was a fire hydrant for a second. The way it's like, who would put a fire hydrant that close to a house? Seems a little ridiculous. Oh man. Who's sleepy? I might be. Just a little. It's a long day, but I mean, going to the vat and having them be able to do the blood work right there and not have to wait was really good. So I'm really happy about that. <sighs> I'm not going to take Fox with me to go see the slavers either. I think I'm going to leave him home for that. So I don't think he'd be too happy. I'm not happy about having to go here either. Oh wait, let's go home and dump my weight first. Simply because... Simply because... So thank you guys all for tuning in and the following and the liking and the subscribing and whatever it happens to be, the plus one-ing. Thank you guys, really. I appreciate it. Um... Patiently await your word. I feel very overdressed in this. I have to figure out what else is going to go on that shelf as well. Do, 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 blood packs. So much sorting. So much stuff. Oh, three more teddy bears. A happy part of the... The happy part of the leaving stuff. I love the rolling pan. I'm sorry. I think it's funny as all heck. 147. What am I carrying? Oh, the pre-war books. Okay. And the teddy bears and those. Okay. All makes sense now. We're good. So the teddy bear bed from the PS3 has begun again. Ooh, don't you dare fall down the back. Don't you dare. You little bugger, get up here. There you go. He looks slightly bigger than his friends. Is that just me? Doesn't he look slightly bigger? He is bigger. Look at him. You know what? This is probably an illusion. No, no, Teddy Bear, don't, don't, don't do this slide against the thing. That looks like I'm trying to kill you, and I'm not trying to kill you. Hope things are going well Ooh, today, no, no, madam. slow down. Slow down. He is a little bit bigger. Look at that. Oh, shit. Gonna totally mess up this whole teddy bear thing. Just so you guys know what's gonna happen. Not because I want it to, but because... Oh, shoot. 
just want to have them sitting nicely together. I have this set up so well on the PS3. I'm not even going to admit to you guys how much time it took for me to get it that way, though. <gasps> Listen, I'm concerned about my teddy bear collection too, Fox, but you know what? <sighs> Damn it. That looks horrible. <sighs> oh. Nothing I can do, right? See, he looks normal sized. Do, 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 do. Hovering teddy bears, hovering teddy bears. I've hit that random part of the night, just in case you guys were wondering. <sighs> so, thanks for tuning in. Sorry for your ears. <laughs> That teddy bear is going to drive me. Oh, you know what? I haven't checked to see if... Um, if... All those little mini gnomes are still up there. I patiently await your word. Yeah, there they are. Itsy bitsy teeny tiny little gnomes, which I was trying to set up on the chessboard, but the chessboard was possessed, so I left it. Oh, it was fabulous, huh? I, are going I need well you to wait today, here, my Adam. handsome friend. And my sweet dog. I patiently await your... Because I have to go to a place I don't want to go. I'd as much prefer to do it without as many witnesses as possible. <laughs> but you guys have just seen me mez the guy in Minefield, so... Not much secrets between us. Thanks to you, we finally have that sniper, Arkansas, in a collar. You have no idea how many good men that prick put into the dirt. Eh. I'm tempted not to sell him, just so we can torment him. Use him for target practice or something. <laughs> Here's another collar. Keep those hoochies rolling in and you'll be rich in no time. Yeah, yeah. Go on up, hotshot. Just don't screw around, or things will get ugly. No second chances. Got it? Super duper. Oh, I hate this place. The only reason I go here is because I know there's a legendary vault suit up here, and I want to free the kids eventually. Well, not eventually, but as soon as I can. So... Carter. <sighs> oh God, lady, you gotta help us. You gotta get us out of here. What? The fuck are you looking at, huh? Goddamn right. This place, I really hate this place. So I'm not married to be here. I always think there's like a little hidden thing there, but there's not. Go open the doors to Paradise City, shall we? That's what I call it. You can call it Paradise Falls if you like. Who's going to do this? Because I don't want to get killed. And I tend to... Um, yeah. Alright, where are we going in this uh, sleaze bag of a place? One wrong move, and you're going in the meat pen. You don't look like you belong here. If I do an evil playthrough, this is the place, I'm telling you. We're going to make friends here. This will pretty much guarantee an evil playthrough. You need you need guns? I got guns. You need armor? Got that too. So long as you got the caps for them. Yeah, pretty much. Take it apart, put it back together. It ain't hard. Sometimes I design my own weapons too. 
Well, the guys usually bring in what they grab on missions. I mean, you always got to kill a few people when you're gathering meat. You know, they've got some guards. The dad thinks he's a hero and pulls a gun, whatever. So they bring that crap in here and trade it. But mostly, the only stuff I get is from these guys. And they keep the good stuff for themselves. Well, awesome. Guys, I'm just getting totally comfortable here tonight. I was as comfortable as I can get, so... <sighs> Yeah, pretty much. Greedy assholes. I don't know how I'm supposed to pull down a living over here when they don't trade fair. I'd have to have some decent supplies to trade for them. If I have more things that these douchebags want, they'll bring me better stuff to trade. But you know, I'm a one-man operation here. Not like I get out a lot. Pretty much, my business is at the mercy of assholes. Fucking free market, man. Yeah, I know. I could really get this little shithole going if I had some better stuff. First things first, bring me some Chinese assault rifles. People always need them for parts. Twenty should get me going. I'll huh? trade them off, and I should be able to improve my stock pretty fast. I honestly don't know why. Um. Well, I can't really kick much away right now. But once I get running, I'll be able to offer you much better stuff. And, of course, as my business partner, you'll get a discount on everything. All right. 20 Chinese assault rifles and we're in business. Great. Just bring any you find back to me. Any piece of shit will do. I'm just going to be breaking them apart and trading the parts. You know where to find me. Awesome. Sure, man. Take a look. The boys bring me all sorts of shit. Oh, uh, see, that has to be... Well, that's fixed among my favorite armor. It really does. I know we shouldn't be rewarding the jerks. I know we shouldn't. <sighs> yeah. Thanks. Yeah, sure. No problem at all. These guys are awful fat. Oh, Hell no. Oh, my. Although that would be really nice to have it fixed that far, wouldn't it? Uh, you got good repair skill. Bye. But my pockets aren't quite that deep yet. Hmm. <laughs> Sticky. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. Let's have a look around. As long as we don't steal nothing and get, or, okay, let me phrase that. As long as we don't get caught stealing anything. We should be fine. But therein lies the catch, isn't it? All right. That wasn't really worth the exploration time, but I can never remember what's anywhere, so it's been too long. Yeah, yeah. One wrong move. Yeah, yeah. I know. Oh yeah, I gotta find the holding pen too. You went out with Emer last week, didn't you? Catch anything good? No, can't say I did. Watch it. Uh, bite me. Goddamn tin can. 
I believe. What do you want? That you went out with Amir last week, didn't you? Catch anything good? Well, I mean, I caught Sticky, but that wasn't really that hard. That sounds all kinds of wrong, so just take the high ground on that one, folks. To be honest with you, I remember this being... Little fuckers got away from us. It's a heck of a walk for, for a bath, I'm just saying. How's the meat? Uh, I, I thought it was on like a shelf. From Evergreen Mills. I thought it was on like one of these. Yes, right there. Okay, that's what we need. We can't do it right now. We have to wait for everybody to go to sleep. So. I'm just wait it out. I think it's cute. They have an ironing board. I think it's great, actually. I think one of them should friggin' come iron for me. So, 45 minutes. We'll be here 45 minutes more, waiting for all the lovely slavers and raiders to go to sleep. Because Paradise Falls is such a fun place to visit. This is pushing it towards morning. Ooh, uh -huh. look, a new toy. Hey, Jotun. Why, look what we have here. Some fresh meat, right out of the wastes. You just want to go ahead and jump in the pen with the others? Or should I beat you senseless and drag you there myself? I ain't mean, not by a long shot. You want to see mean? You should have met my daddy. That son of a bitch had cut your legs off just to laugh at you trying to crawl away. I saw him do it once, too. Just kept laughing at this poor bastard. After an hour or so, Daddy got bored and crushed his skull with a rock. Come to think of it, that was pretty funny. You don't get out much, yeah. I guess, huh? Yeah, see ya. <clears throat> All right, then. Carolina. Uh. That's cute. Go play. How'd that roundup go? Roundup went pretty good. Six hours. Maybe they go out. Wow, does nobody ever leave? Yeah, we're all gonna leave. Look, totally. Okay. Fabulous. Okay, bye bye. Oh, one more. Hey, don't mind me, just here checking my shit. My stuff. Yeah, nope, nothing going on. Just admiring your, um, dedication to your decorating. Are you not gonna leave? You need to go out the door. Go on. Aw, look at you. You're such a cute little varmint. Later. You need to leave. She sees me, I will die. She sees me, and I will die. This will not end well. Oh, look, it's Miss Lola. Let me feed my stuff to my brother. Just slinking around up here. A new toy. Ooh, look. You like me so One much? One wrong move and you're going in the meat pen. I'm not going in the meat pen. You've got hopes. Well, I will. To rescue the people in there. But other than that... You know, some things you begin to wonder about my sanity. I'm 
I'm just saying. It's locked for a reason. Don't get any ideas. You're a mess. I hope you brought a lot of money with you. Bye. She seems really, really perky for somebody who's like. Okay. So, so far, I'm killing my karma, like, left, right, and center. And woo for that, right? Totally woo. Um, see, you know what happens. Um, and it never fails. I get turned around in this place ridiculously bad. So... Last mistake, <laughs> little bartender. Oh, Ain't none of my business. Where? <laughs> Hello, I am Ymir. Does it matter? It only matters where I am, and that is here. I have my boy, my friends, plenty of caps, and strong drink. Why would the past matter when now is so good? Yeah, well, you know, he does have a point. He put water in my vodka to make more caps from me. Make the drink weak. Try to charge me more. Maybe the next bartender, he won't be so stupid, huh? <laughs> Bye. So I'm dropping frames at like 23%. Not exactly tickled about that. But it being sort of a one of those nights, I guess. How'd that roundup go? We're just gonna go along with it, see how it goes, right? All right. Catch any good meat lately? I ended up with a pack of heroes. They tried to escape. Yeah? We ended up just having to put them down. Mm. Get your business done and go. So if you travel, he has one of the best outfits here, I'm just saying. Down. He really does. Um, not outfits as in like setups, but outfits as in literal outfits. Uh. Oh. Yeah, he's hovering. Crimson, let's stay down to earth, shall we? No more daydreaming. Why do you have to yell all the time, Eulogy? I'm standing right here. What have I said about back talk, Crimson? Hmm? What have I said? I'm sorry. What? Sorry. Try that again. I'm sorry, sir. There's a good girl. Now I gotta go see 40. I like how he just walks by you like you're in his place. You like what you see? Talk to Mr. Eulogy. Mr. Eulogy don't like me talking to the Johnnies without his permission. Oh, this place is so gross. This place is as gross as going to... Going to Dukovs, and I hate to say that, but... Hmm. All right. I'm sure we're still hidden because this makes you not at all popular with the locals. I'm sure you can uh, figure that much out if you've never done this before.
Oh my goodness. Do not have the hacking brain on tonight. The hacking hat is not on. is also a nuka cola quantum or a few of them i should say this is where you start losing karma so you have to be very careful depending on your followers um if this is really worth it to you because you may not be in a position to steal everything and not piss people off so be careful about that because I've had Fox walk off and leave me because of a little bit of a uh, little bit of accessories I brought home shall we say so interesting. I don't know this would be my selection for, you know, prime bathtub spot, but you know. Sure the shine off of my <laughs> off of my tuckus would probably blind enough people anyways. That it wouldn't matter too much. <laughs> oh shoot. Watch it. It's fine, the great Things eulogy. Things are quiet around here. We haven't had any good roundups in a while. Uh, Watch your step, Square. You need to be uh, up. Great to be. You must be our prospective customer. I do hope Paradise Falls can accommodate your needs. We make no judgments, no assumptions. We understand that it's a harsh world out there, and you do what you must to make it. Now, was there something specific you were interested in? <laughs> oh. Well then, you and I are a perfect fit. You want to buy slaves and I want to sell them. There are some prime specimens out there. Have you had a chance to look them over? Very good eye, my friend. Those little ones are good as a long-term investment. They have their other uses as well, I'm sure. They are most definitely up for sale. For starters, I'm thinking 500 caps each for the little ones. Sammy and Penny, I think their names are. Now the other one, Squirrel, that's a talented kid. 500 would be a crime. I'm thinking a thousand caps for him, bringing us to a total of two thousand caps. Speech at a hundred, oh my goodness. That's a lot of caps. I suppose I can accept that. It's a deal. The kids are yours. I'll have them delivered to the front gate for you. If I may, you might want to keep a close eye on them. They can be willful at times. Good luck. I've never done this quest Don't like mind that. Energy. 
Daddy don't pay no attention to us. Keep staring and I'll start charging. I've never done that quest that way. I've always paid to get them released. Or not paid to get them. I've always, like, well, I've paid in, like, blood and sweat and tears, but. Okay. Uh, I don't know that I necessarily like the way that went. I may have to say it to load and try this again. Oh, come on. Pay more attention to what you're doing. Yeah, yeah. Eulogy, I know you came in here, dude. Alright, so I'm gonna have to do the quest the other way to get the other guys released. Bugger. I swear to you, he came in here. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm glad I got the kids. That's great. But I kinda wanna get these guys too. How did eulogy go? <sighs> I feel like I I don't I feel like that's totally wrong that I need to go back and do this differently so that I can get them all and stop spinning around for you guys because totally that's not cool either. Lady, we're not going anywhere with you. You don't own us. Rescued? This is a pretty stupid way to rescue anybody, Mungo. Well, no. You better be telling the truth, Mungo, or else we're gonna kill you in your sleep. So if you're serious, let's get moving. Sammy says so. I don't like these kids. They're jerks. What? I'm busy, so piss off. You got business here, you talk to Eulogy. Where the hell did Eulogy go? Okay, there she is. Don't mind Eulogy. Daddy don't pay no attention to us. Talked about this before, haven't you? Okay, Welcome to Paradise okay, Ball, I'm sorry. Whatever you have to say, it can I wait. I can see what you're doing, you're not you know. here to talk. I know, but you said that we... Did I speak communist to you? I said that I don't want to talk about it. You will be quiet, or you Ms. will Mother. regret it. Take it up with Eulogy. Yes, sir. Mr. Eulogy. Sorry, huh? sir. Can I talk to you for Pronto a second? said he wanted to talk to Did me about know? something. Keep up, ladies. Why are you bothering me, Clover? Hmm? What do you want? Oh, you die in your sleep, but, you know. We've talked about this before. 
full heaven. Here on business. Oh yeah, I'm here on business. She's looking at me again. What do you want, Square? I don't I I mean I'm glad but like twelve hundred caps and I don't get the collars off of anybody else, which kinda sucks. Cause I kinda think the collar should come Hello. off of everybody else too. And I also want his outfit. <laughs> there is that as well. So we're not gonna pay for the kids. We're gonna. <sighs> Guess what? Probably not a good idea when you've already hacked something. To yeah. Okay, that wasn't so bad then. Do 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 run along. Thank you. Do 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 do. Hi, how you doing? Oh yeah, I gotta go steal all that Nuka Cola again. We're not losing karma, and I realize that now, so... We should be okay. We should be. I don't really remember how this quest goes. I just know I've stolen a hat and some Nuka Cola. Uh, now we need the rest of the outfit. Welcome to the start of second hour. Um, kind of retracing my steps here a little bit because Tell me what you see. What am I Watch it, will you? It looks fine. Have you suddenly gone blind, Forty? Do I need to replace my blind second in command? Look around. You see what I'm talking about now. I guess when you put it that way, yeah. There are a few things that could stand to be tightened up. I'll get on. Forty, if you were any dumber, I'd make a signpost out of you. Let's go see how business looks today. If you're I've not busy, Mr. Eulogy, to you, I, Mr. Eulogy, I want to talk to you for a second. I know, I wanted to but talk you said to that you we... About, Did I you speak communist to you? About her. Yes, sir. We've talked about this Sorry. before, haven't we? Get us some new stock. Hey! Hey, lady! Can you get us out of here? Can't you just. Well, I mean, Squirrel thinks. Squirrel's good with computers, and they don't know he made this one work again. But it's. Nice. A... It... It's not. Hang on. I'll get Squirrel, and he can tell this you what's so to do. much more fun. I mean, 1200 caps, and the kids are mine. We don't get to take these nice people with hey, us, so. We'll talk I thought they don't really make it anyways, Let's go. but... Nothing going on here. Let's go. Whatever you have. You're the Mungo that's helping us, huh? No, uh, before I... Sammy says you want to know the plan. Well, listen up, Mungo, because it's a good one. I'm super smart. Alrighty, then. Mr. 
Man, you're cranky. Yes, yes, I am. Fine. Here's what you do. You go on to the boss guy's room and use his terminal. Get the one in here added to the network. Think you can handle that, Mungo? Ah. Uh, probably not, but... I told you. It's in the boss guy's room. I Great. Then that means we're... <sighs> oh, come on. Aren't you Mungo's good for anything? I'm a kid. I can do it. Why can't you? Listen, if you can't make that work, there might be one other way to do it. Even for a stupid Mungo like you. There's a junction box along the wall in the eating area. Switch a few cables there and we're good. So there you go. Either you better be pretty good at fixing stuff, or you better learn how to use a terminal real fast. Jeez. Thank you. I know, but you said that we... Right away, Daddy. Yes, sir. Sorry, I'm sorry. Sir. I'm so sorry. Haven't I always said that I hate to wait? Why you always have to make me wait? What's wrong with you? Hey there, Please pretty. forgive me, Daddy. I, it won't happen again. Just tell me what you need. Anything. I'll do anything. I'm afraid of this answer. You like what you see? Talk to Mr. Eulett. You must be our prospective customer. We make no... Now. Yeah, we sat through this, so... Sure, I've thought about it. Kids can get a killer price when you find a buyer who recognizes the product's long-term potential. The real problem's holding them until there's a buyer. Kids are sneaky, and those lamplighters are tenacious little bastards. But maybe if we could get one when they're young, they might not have as much fight in them yet. Sure, if you think you can pull it off, I think I might know a buyer who'd be interested. I'll send one of my best to wait around the entrance to Lamplight. You go in and find the sweetest, most trusting little one you can find. No. Oh, that kid outside, and everyone's happy. Except the kid, of course. Well, then, you and I are a perfect fit. They're awesome. Well, you should. Go on out, take a gander, and see if there's anything that might meet your needs. I will point out that there are a few kids out there. Not something you see very often. A very good long-term investment. We can discuss details once you've had a chance to look things over. Gee. This if one really should have come with like a... Uh... I want to talk to you for a second. Seriously, hello? It's... it's about Crimson. I think that maybe it's time to let her go like you said you would. So that we can be together alone. Yes, sir. Sorry, sir. Yes, Daddy. I'm sorry, Daddy. Don't mind eulogy. Daddy don't pay no attention to us. All right. Watch uh, your step, Square. We're gonna wait Nothing till he goes to sleep and Let's bump go. him off. I think. Goddamn tin can. This goes, this goes all kinds of wrong, in case you guys didn't figure that out. Just saying. No, sir, I don't know where your hat went to. face around here. <laughs> All 
Apparently he's gotta go to the bathroom Catch or something. Any good meat lately? What? We don't like outsiders here. Well, I don't like being here if it's any consolation to you. Okay. What's up, Mongo? You fixed that terminal yet? All right. You're okay for a Mongo, you know that? So we're one step closer to getting out of here. Well, with the terminal, I can turn off the collars and open up the gate. But they're not gonna just let us walk out of here, well, you know? shucks. There's always at least one guard near the pen. And someone's gotta get rid of him. Since we can't just walk around like we own the place, you're gonna have to do it. You get me? Man. Around midnight, there's only one guard. But it's that really mean guy, 40. Still, probably your best chance to try something. Do what you gotta do, you know? Just get him away from his post. Okay, don't do anything stupid. Well, that's kind of hey. out of my uh, realm of possibilities then, isn't it? Okay. I've had some screaming run-throughs here. I'm just saying. I have had some definite screaming run-throughs in this place. Uh, yeah. Hopefully this will not turn into one of them. I hope. Hopefully all in all this is a relatively easy playthrough as far as getting these guys out of here. We'll see soon, I guess, right? I really want to try to get Eulogy's clothes. We're going to go back in here. Uh, I don't know when he goes to sleep. Once I figure that out, I'll be good. Looks like one of those brotherhood assholes. She might be right. I ain't saying nothing. We got the pip boy, right? So yay for that. Um No oh, screw me. I think they probably go in. Probably like regular time. So. You like what you see? Talk to Mr. Eulogy. So we're at ten thirty. They're going out roaming. Guess what we're here. Range for 40 to be away from the slave pen. <sighs> we
We got a reason to be talking I ain't aware of. Huh? Yeah, I mean, they pay well enough, I guess. What the hell do you care? Maybe. And maybe it's time to see eulogy about a raise. See, and then I do stupid stuff like this where I'm like, no, I'm going the wrong friggin' way. So what's the deal, Mungo? Now don't worry. We're out of here. Me and Sammy can make it no problem. The drain in the bathroom is small. We'll fit through, but Mungo's can't. But you gotta tell Penny it's time to go. She's being all dumb and won't listen to us. You gotta talk to her. This Mungo, Roy McLaren. She got all sweet on him or something. I don't know. It's some stupid girl thing. But they threw him in the box because he was giving them shit. And they won't let him out. So Penny says she ain't going until she knows he's safe. I told her she's stupid. Hell, I don't know. Go talk to her. Try and get her to get out while she can. Me and Sammy are getting out of here now, though. If you can get her to come, meet us east of here after you're out. You're the Mungo that helped Sammy and Squirrel, aren't you? Well, I already told them I'm not going anywhere. Not without Rory. No! I'm not leaving while they still got Rory locked up. He's the only person that's been nice to me. I'm not just gonna leave him like that. You have to get Rory out of the box. He's locked in there, and the guards have the key. I think Forty has one. I don't know where the other one is. Probably the boss guy has it. Or it's in his room. You find the key, you can get Rory well, we'll out, see. and then I'll leave. We'll see. Because, um... Reasons. What is it? Can't you see that I'm watching? I'm watching the patrols. What do you think I'm looking at? They switch it up a little bit every day, but just a little. There has to be some sort of pattern to it. It's just a matter of watching and waiting. Bye. All right, well. Hey, be more careful. Um, let's see if he killed 40. do anything. Oh, he's following me. Damn. Probably gonna end Open that one. Fire. Where? from here. I want to see if we can't get him to come up here or something. Kill him and move him out of the way. Oh, 
Oh, my eyes itchy. Guys, it's falling apart slowly here tonight now. Oh, and you know when you rub your eye and you get like sweat or salt or whatever the heck it is in it? Not, don't take that that way. <laughs> oh, technical difficulties, right? It's the way the day goes. Water. Damn it. Oh, my eye is so watering. This is horrible. Badly. You guys know this, right? I don't know. No idea what happened here. None at all. Open this door and it's going to be nothing but stupidity. Oh, yeah. Apparently that didn't work real well. Oh, shit. It's fun to try a couple different hey, ways though, 40. I'm not gonna lie to you. Back off before I put a bullet in you. I'm watching you. He's got a clear line of sight to me, and I can't get to him from here. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. This is where you call. Can I wedge myself in here and not get stuck? Crimson? Hey there. Hey, Crimson. Hell? What you want? Uh-huh. And what makes you... Maybe he could. Maybe. Maybe I'll go see how he's doing. Maybe there's something I could do for him. Oh my. You ain't gonna say a word about this, right? Whatever. Hey there, sugar. Lonely night. The hell you want, Crimson? Oh, nothing. I was just sitting around, all bored, bored and anxious, and thinking maybe I could find something to do. I mean, maybe we could. That's a pretty stupid idea, even for you. You and Gita would kill us both. Yeah, he might. Except he ain't gonna know nothing about it. Come on. I see the way you look at me. I can really get 
you something to look at. I'll... Come on, Forty. Let's go take a break. All right. All right. Just keep quiet. Not a good idea. I've killed people for looking at me like that. Trying a couple things here, guys. Um... That worked out okay. Nobody noticed. Uh, yeah. Seems successful to me. Oh, my eyes itchy again. Get out of here! They see me talking to you. I'm dead. See me talking to you, I'm dead. We're in the box. They're never gonna know. Get out of here. They see me talking to you, I'm dead. Alright. You enjoy them. <laughs> My boy, he is so big. Look at him. He carry four slaves under his arms. He doesn't even need a gun to take them. You embarrass me, father. I do not care. Let them see that I am proud of my boy. You have nothing to be ashamed of, Jotun. I only do as you talk right. to your father. Um, let's go unlock some stuff, maybe. You're making it dangerous for us all. Keep your voice down, old man. Listen, if you're not part of the solution, then you're part of the problem. What? Uh huh? Me? You're talking to me? Yes, sir. Yes? I am. What do you need? Yeah, see you. Please, help me. Miss Jeanette. This place is terrible, please. You've got to help us. Please. Uh, I think I'm going to wait till midnight. Oh, I feel really bad. And, uh... We'll get them all to run out. We could find eulogy right now. How'd that roundup go? We might send him in to go after them. Jotun. No, it is not nice. What do you want? I keep my father safe. It is. A big job. Yeah, see ya. Ooh, look. A new toy. Can't remember if you can, like, kind of squeal them out to somebody else. How's the meat? It's horrible. Hmm. Get out of here. They see me talking to you, I'm dead. All right, we may just have to tell her to make a run for it because... Um, oh, come on, pay more attention to what you're doing. 
Hey, how'd it go with that blonde thing you brought in here? Keep staring and I'll start charging. Nice. Real, real classy. Alright. So, we're our 43rd time in and out of How's there. The meat? We're just gonna, we're gonna wait it out till it gets dark. And we're gonna pop his open and the other ones open and we're gonna tell them to run. It's not gonna end well, but it'll be a good distraction for me to get out of here. Oh, on that note, I have to retrace my steps so that I'm headed the right way. How'd that roundup go? Not How'd too bad. Go? A couple of deadbeat buyers, though. And need I remind you that I'm old enough to be your mother. Ours is a business relationship only. Oh, there's no need to be like that, Cutter. You know I'm only joking. What do you Speaking think you're doing? Of business, you have my money. Here you go, Eulogy. The usual cut. Count it if you'd like. Let's see what's going on over at the bar. Well, let's see if we can't. Uh... Let's leave our just let me know if you need anything. Paradise Fall. Awesome. I really want a suit. That's what I want. So I'm trying to uh, trying to decide in my head how I'm going to do this. Hey, you're back. You get anything good? All right. How am I going to do this? Distract 40, I run over, I tell the kid, the guy's not worth it. Things are quiet around here. We haven't had any good roundups in a while. I'm going to throw a stealth a boy on my butt and try to get out of here. They see me talking to you, I'm dead. All right, kid, he ain't going. Where is 40? He's still in here? Clover, stay nearby. Let's not cause a scene. Yes, Daddy? I'm sorry. I'm busy, so piss off. You got business here, you talk to you. Damn right you're sorry. When I say something, you better listen. Hell, you should know I think we're going to get them out of here. And I think we're going to come back and kill them. That works for me. Alright, so. What's going to happen now is we're going to pretty much make sure everything's quiet. Why are you two still here? So, you're getting this free or what? Can what? Squirrels? Hey. Hey, that's the Mungo. So what's the deal, Mungo? Okay. Oh, don't worry. But you... Hell, I don't know. Go me. Okay, we're not gonna sit through dialogue that we've already done. 
You're the Mongol that helped Sammy. Okay. Well, okay. I got the key. I'll go see if I can talk to this guy. Cut it out. Get there. Gate open. I'm ready to go. And you again? What are you doing? Annoying the crap out of you. Just make so. You. Is Rory safe yet? Thank you so. Now I have. Okay, bye-bye. Well, we're not drawing attention to ourselves at all, are we? This place is terrible. Freedom! This isn't gonna end well. Hey, you wanna see something funny? Hey. What? Uh-huh? What do you want? Make it Look what we have here. Shit, wrong way. I did this every time, didn't I? I said I'm going to make sure I go the right way. It didn't even go the right way. They just caused total chaos for absolutely no reason. Yeah. They don't even know it was me. This is freaking great. I've got something for you. Except for they're all gonna be dead now, right? Miss Jeanette. Oh no. You can't we'll get him. That's it, that's it. That hey, you it out. Hey, you get anything good? Oh, this is horrible. <laughs> it could be worse. One wrong move, Hello. and you're going in the meat pen. Red. <laughs> Right, well, they don't know that I had anything to do with it, so I think that's probably okay. Ooh, I mean, look, it's not okay because they died, but... Things are quiet around here. Oh, I'm conflicted. I'm so conflicted. Should I go back and reload and then just... Yeah, I should, shouldn't I? Just in case. Just in case we decide to go that way. This is called the Choose Your Own Adventure Night. It's totally what this is. We're gonna... I don't know. Like, the kids got out. That's kind of the point of it. Just let me know if you Paradise Falls is here. I think I bring Fox back and we clear this place out. I think that's our plan. All right.
We'll get the kid ready. We got the key. Let's get Fox. And Watch it. Just leave me alone. Just leave me alone. I don't care about stupid escape plans. We're stuck here for good. We should be able to wipe them out. That's horrible, isn't it? All right, so we get eulogy and his key. We'll bring Fox in. We'll go. And we'll wipe out everybody in that place. And then we'll slowly wipe our gu wipe the guards out. Or we'll wipe the guards out on the way in or something. That's my plan, guys. Fudge. I guess that'd be too easy, wouldn't it? Hey, I'm just gonna leave now. Fast travel. <laughs> I have, you know what, I haven't really played around too much with this scenario ever, so I'm sorry for putting you guys through it. I just really wanted to try a couple different things and see how it might go. So. And I think it went, it's gonna go okay, so. Can I fast travel from here? I think that's the wisest thing. Mm, it's horrible and I feel like I'm taking Fox on like a suicide mission, but... I think this is really the only way to do it. I got his hat so far. <laughs> Right, so we're a little bit ahead of the game. It's horrible, I know, but like to I just I enjoy trying a few different things. And I wanna make sure that I kinda do it the optimal way, and I don't think I've ever taken a follower with me to go wipe people out, so I think this is going to be an experience, to say the least, probably. <sighs> probably live to regret it, but, you know. I hope things are going well for you today, madam. Keep my lucky eight ball. to make some karma back so I think oh shoot I think I'm gonna lose that teddy bear down the back of the bed no we've got a jumper no no oh <gasps> don't you dare oh my possessed teddy bear says no all right that's okay you're building a mound of teddy bears like this yeah, kind of gotta be expecting sometimes they're gonna go a little floopsy moopsies on you. <sighs> All right. I think with Fox, we should be able to do this. Take my plasma rifle and yeah, let's do this. Welcome home, madam. I had if it doesn't work, we're gonna blame it on my headset digging With on top of my head. Haste. Alright, Fox, get ready for a fight. That's all I'm gonna say. 
We may have to wait another day to do this, but... I don't know how to do this. There's a better way. Ain't no reason to stick around here, is there? Kinda think fighting our way in is the better option. Searching for that special something? Oh jeez, crazy wolf gang. Dude. Hey, hey, looking to buy? I scour the wasteland for the very best peat, and I always make sure to make my. See you out on. Hey, get. Hello. Oh. Doc Hoff is dead somewhere. And so will these guys be if they don't get out of here before the poop hits the fan, shall we say? All right. I think this is a horrible idea. <laughs> I really think this is a horrible idea, but... Okay, they're safely out of the way. Alright, let the madness begin. Probably gonna lose karma for this. You won't let me target them because he's friendly, right? Assault, assault. Oh, it's he's friendly. Your death is my oh no. Strictly business, huh? Failed? I think I can live with that. Sorry, dude. But, yeah, no. That quest is just horrible. I don't mind failing that quest. Just saying. Well, we might have been able to keep them alive and kill the people here. I'm not sure how this works. Because one doesn't seem to know about the other. I'm intrigued. I think we have to kill them anyway, so. I've never done this, so I kind of want to know what happens if I do this. I know it's horrible. I know. Oh my goodness, Fox, dude. This is like horrendous. That's great. No more games. Time to die. It's, it's really awesome. So be careful. kind of fun taking Fox to do this. I ain't gonna tell you no different. Look at the karma I'm gaining back.
Mm. Horrible. This is absolutely horrible that I'm doing this. Gosh, this is just getting fabulous. Well, I guess let's go find Eulogy and say hello, huh? This is really, really, really wrong. Clover and the rest of them, but they're not nice people. <laughs> Thank you, Fox. <gasps> I feel horrible, but you know what? I kind of feel like that maybe was a good thing. Now, what we're gonna find out. You have something um, to say? <laughs> Sorry, guys. Yes, by um, all means. Let's... What we're gonna find out is that we're not gonna be able to. Um... <sighs> Sorry, I'm sneezing. So I'm not going to be able to, um... And I shall save the kids or something. Because everything's dead. <laughs> but... <coughs> Sorry. Also, we should be able to save this guy as well. Oh no. Okay. You got the gate, huh? Okay, we're <laughs> out of here. Shoot a couple of those Mungo ass bag slavers for me, will ya? Watch it. Okay, oh, yeah, apparently she doesn't care now. This place is terrible. Freedom! Please hope. I hope they make it. Hey, hey, bl hey! You want to see something funny? Hey, no now. Th what do you want? Make now. What? Uh huh. What? And. Get out of here. Well, y'all need to move and we'll all get out of here, I think. Uh oh. Alright, well, that didn't end well, did it? Let's see if we can't make sure these guys get out of here at the very least. Is someone there? This place is awful. 
Well, I've never ever done it that way before. Are these guys like coming out or are they just gonna stay here or what's the story? They're going. Okay. Alright. Wonder if they'll still trade with me. Let's find out, shall we? Probably gonna kill me on sight. That's the barracks. He might still trade with me. Oh, she might, actually. She might kill me, though. What do you want? Alright, she seems unaffected. So... Let's go to the lock and load and see if he'll still buy Chinese rifles from me. Probably killed him. No more games. Oh, shit. Time to die. Where? Your time is come. Damn. All right, why not answer that? I can't say I've ever done Paradise Falls quite this way before. Oh, jeez, I feel bad. But, um, I guess there's a first time for everything, right? Hey, can I, um, can I, can I borrow your key? Thanks, that's super. This was really, really horrible. Um, I just want you guys to know that. I have somewhat remorse for this. I don't want to say... Oh my gosh. No karma. This is freaking great. I can't believe I've never done it like this before. Something. My conscience, but Yes. By all means. Um, let's He still seems happy with me, so as long as Fox is happy with me, I'm happy. I mean, I'm out of place to sell the rifles. I think I can live with that. You really do. I think I can live with that. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I, I think, I think, I think this is the most horrible way I've ever done this one. They were nice people. I mean, is it so bad that I would, you know, pay back the favor, I guess, shall we call it? I don't know. I don't think so. Hedgy will absolutely <laughs> lose his mind when he when I he I tell him I did this quest this way this time. Uh, yeah, he's gonna be. So the clinic's still here. 
I'm sure that... Opening fire! Fox, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I don't even know what to think of Fox at this point. Uh, I am a little bit scared. Uh, dude is... crazy overpowered and I'm so tickled that he likes me <laughs> cuz if he didn't I couldn't kill him oh, I'm sorry that you're get dead I really am sorry that you're gonna get dead I don't know how to... all right let's fix a couple This is so not like me to do this this way. I don't even know what's come over me. I'm pretty happy. <laughs> oh my goodness. Actually, that's not a bad idea. Let's use that to fix the silenced. Three oh four, huh? So many. Ah, uh, this is. I think one of the easiest resolutions I've ever had here. It's very unlike me, but I can get behind it. I'm sure that three dog will not be happy with me, which is going to be my big issue. But there is safety in mindfulness. I'm sorry, I'm still really stunned that this place is just... I mean, if you're gonna escape anyways, you're gonna have to end up killing a few of them. Or all of them. So this worked out okay. I mean, the kids are free, and... I'm concerned about this area. I think this worked out okay. <laughs> you kind of left a mess. Just a little. <laughs> Oops. Um. All right. Well, that's Paradise Falls, guys. <laughs> oh wow. No. What killed you? Oh, that was the original dude, wasn't it? Okay. The other guys went back in the in their their pen or their cage or whatever you want to call it. Be aware of our surroundings. Poor Brahmin. Okay, where are these kids? Hi there. Worf, thanks for getting us out of there, Mungo. We're gonna head back home now. I'd think twice about coming back here if I were you. 
These guys aren't going to forget you, you know. Pardon me. All right, we have to go now to Little Lamplight because we sent the slaver there. I don't know if we did that before the save or after the save, so I just want to make sure. There's no... Oh, there is. Shit. Fight! <laughs> there is waiting here. Not good at all. I'm torn between silent running and concentrated fire, but I think I'm gonna go... See, it's very different when you're traveling with Fox to compare it when you're traveling on your own. So, traveling with Fox is like... You kinda don't have to be as worried. Just waiting for you to bring me a new friend. Oh, this will be swift, but painful. Yeah, no, you're not waiting on anything. Sorry to break that to you. <laughs> That's absolutely horrible. I three dog is gonna hate me. I feel bad. I do. I know it sounds ridiculous, but I feel bad because it's like... Merc Adventure outfit. That's what I need. 301. Are you kidding me? Ah. Alright. So the kids of Little Lamplight are now safe. <laughs> Yay! My conscience will bug me that I had to wipe out the whole thing of raiders, but, you know, let's serve the evils, I guess. <laughs> I guess. Alright, so welcome to the, the start of third hour. Um, technically, I should go home and, and get rid of this stuff. And then, now that we've gotten the child slaver out of the way, because that's just creepy and wrong and yeah. I'm concerned about this area. Well, it was horrible, but it was good, right? So. We have O.J. Jones' suit and his hat's in here somewhere. 
so wrong. I know. Think of the nice people we, uh, we helped save. Right? Okay. Fox, may you I get all the crap I've given you? Yes. By all means. Let's. I'm having Skyrim flashbacks, Not and I touch buttons, and I think, oh my god, I'm going to end up destroying it or something. So, you guys forgive me sometimes when I have that panic look that crosses my face, like, I'm going to ruin this. <laughs> it's ESO and um, Skyrim seeping in. Some whiskey drink, you drink some lager drink, you drink some something drink, and you drink more drink. Alright. Ooh, we got some money here. Holy crow. Pre war books alone, we have money. Scrap metal. So we'll take 10. You know what? While I'm trying to figure out what we're going to do, after I dump this, we'll come down and we'll grab some stuff and Hope we'll go. Going well for you today, madam. We'll go do a... The air smells dangerous. Well, that's Wadsworth farting. We can't help that. <sighs> Thank you guys for tuning in. I'm so random, but you guys are used to that by now. And if you're just new here, well, hopefully you'll... You'll... Find it something to appreciate. Or something like that. <sighs> okay. doing all right as far as um, <sighs> guys you know I, I read it it registered and then I went mm. <laughs> I wonder if as soon as I do this you guys will forgive me I want to do a little experiment here Once this saves, I want to um, see if I can drop the slave collar and maybe leave it out on display. We'll see. It's apple juice, I swear. I know it looks, yeah, but it is actually. Actually, apple juice. Apple, apple juice. Oh. Okay, before I do this. Uh, where are we gonna put that? I think let's try to put it downstairs. I hope things are going well for you today, madam. I cannot remove a quest item. I am going to be stuck with a pound. Could mez somebody and put a slave collar on him. <laughs> somebody annoys me. <laughs> Might not be a bad option. I'm just just saying. <laughs> That's so not right, right? All right, what's we got in here? Quantum, she doesn't need it. Well, she'll take more, but we're not gonna give her any more. Those are the mini ones, but I think because they've been in here, they're probably not going to be that good anymore. Um, I've got a pile of books that I need to go put in this room and try to do the chessboard with the little gnomes on it, but I don't want to do that with you guys because well I think it's going to take forever. So I'll do that like off stream one day. Mm, take those. Those. 
those. We only have four blood packs. It's probably not really worth the walk. Two hundred and seventeen Nuka Colas. Holy mother. One sugar bomb. Because it's the one I forgot back here. You know what? Let's do a drop off run. Why not? I mean, we don't necessarily have a lot, but. Alright, so we have books. So, Underworld to do s the start of the metal. And we'll go from there. I'll take my, my trusty friend with me. Has reasons. I'm not going to lie to you. I do feel kind of bad about wiping them out. But I'm sure that they're... Um, Okay, library for library. <laughs> Can't talk. Library first, because books are important. And um, go from there. Oh look, we have like a hidden, not a hidden, but uh, a marker that we haven't been to. Hey, hi! I brought my friend to the library. Hope you don't mind. Welcome back. Have you been successful in your search for books? Excellent. How many are you willing to trade? Very well. Here is your reward. Use it well and return with more books when you can. Of course. I wish that the, the Brotherhood tags hey, were working. Honestly, I, I should have brought them and gone to try them. But... Um, Gonna go drop off his one thing of sugar bombs. <laughs> Seems totally ridiculous. Hey. Excuse me, I don't want to knock any more moving, stuff. Pete. So, what did you bring me? I brought you one box of sugar. Night. My God, Fox. Um, blood packs, and then I don't know why I feel like I have to walk up the steps for this. We still have to explore this, so maybe we'll do that too. I don't know, we'll see. Paradise Falls, I don't think we should go back there for a while. <laughs> um, and then we'll go to the Museum of History. Only one of us will walk away alive. <laughs> okay, this is really bugging me. Every time I come here, this has to happen. Really bugging me. I don't like that at all. Like seriously, seriously, seriously makes me sad. I know we only have four blood packs. It's kind of a walk. So if you guys want me to break, go stretch your legs. Um, I'm just gonna drop them their blood packs off, and then we will go to Underworld. So, assuming I don't get caught on something that I've walked by seventy thousand times. Poor Fox is going to hit his head again. I bring him simply because, like, the dogs like that when I come in here, and I hate having to kill them. Needed a place to get out of the sun for a while. He really upsets me. Honestly, and, and you know, just on a random note while we're walking this, that is one of my pet peeves about this game. You cannot run. Just a slow jog, honestly. 
Just a slow jog would be nice. Um. Oh, hey. Come back to the scary vampire lair. So what do you need? How much caps you got? <laughs> See what he's got. There's something that I need. See, this stuff is fabulous when it's fixed. A little bit of bartering going on here. <laughs> I sell him some stuff. I buy some more stuff off of him. <laughs> it works out very well. Another satisfied cut. There have we. <laughs> All right, let's go see where our lovely vampire friend is. He's probably asleep. Oh no, he's awake. Good, good. Always a pleasure to receive you in Maresti. Again, many thanks. Here is your compensation. Thank you. Now we go to Underworld. Which takes forever. Yeah, I just kind of wish there was like a slow jog or something. Be nice. I mean, I guess if you crouch walk and then you walk like this, it seems fast. So there is that option as well. It's not really running, but it makes it feel like it. So, and we probably should take Fox and just clear out the t the fire lurks on the way here, so we can come straight from. Dropping it off at Murphy so that we don't have to go. Well, we'll have to go outside here when we leave, so it's kind of six of one, half a dozen of the other. It's like fast travel and then deal with the dogs, or walk underground and then deal with them when we go out, so. I wish, like, this is the part where I kind of wish you could fast travel to indoor locations. I get you can't, but she's like, I'm so tired of walking. <laughs> Stomp my feet. Alright, nothing's trying to kill us. That's nice. No. Oh my goodness. I have to do the antagonizers. I do. Um, you know what? I'm going to put some thought into it and do a little bit of research to figure out how I can get the best solution. And... Uh, God. And... <laughs> forgot when you clean the water up all this kind of crap starts happening this is going to mean it's going to be next to impossible to kill that Each chick off yeah. your you're one step closer well hello there smooth skin step right up have you come to savor the great taste of the amazing aqua cura why have you heard otherwise I changed the name to help ghouls realize its amazing properties. And well, just between us, I've also added a few secret ingredients to enhance the flavor of the original. <laughs> it's not exactly so the it's same. Exactly it the tastes same. like crap now. Get Yay. Get a procura bottle. A free sample, you say? Hmm. Well, I normally don't do this, but oh, wow. for you, for this one time only, a very special VIP promotional offer. 
Ladies and gentlemen.